What's up guys, this is Sean Heather and in this video we are going to do a gaming performance test of Oppo Reno 7 Pro 5G smartphone by playing few of the most high and heavy graphics game on the highest possible graphics setting. We will see how much FPS we are going to get, the battery performance and whether we are going to face any hitting issue or not. But before we start, if you are new to this channel, then do not forget to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to get the notification for future uploads. So the screen refresh rate is set to 90Hz, the high performance mode is turned off and we will use the games app with the game turbo feature of Oppo Reno 7 Pro to play all of these games. First of all, let's just start with Injustice 2. So right now the temperature is 26 degrees Celsius, battery percentage is 93 and we will use the Pro Gamer mode to play all of these games on our Oppo Reno 7 Pro 5G to get the best performance out of the device. So this is the maximum volume, I am going to reduce it a bit because it's pretty loud and now let's play the game. So we are getting around 30 FPS here, there was slight lagging for a while when the frame dropped to 17. So we are constantly getting 30 fps, we are not getting 60 fps or better than 30 fps in any way because Injustice 2 supports up to 120 hertz actually. So what I am going to do now is I am going to turn on the high performance mode and let's see whether we are going to get any better performance from the gameplay or not. So we are still getting 30 FPS. There is no improvement in FPS here. So the graphics quality was really nice and we were getting constantly 30 fps just once minor frame drop happened when the frame rate we were getting was only 17 fps other than that it was at 30 fps most of the time and even after turning off the high performance mode we did not see any improvement in the frame rate here so if you are going to play injustice 2 you will get at least 30 fps for sure on our Reno 7 Pro 5G here. The battery percentage moved to 92. Now let's play Alto's Odyssey. This game also supports up to 120 FPS. So let's see how much FPS we are going to get while playing this game on Oppo Reno 7 Pro 5G. Seventy-eight FPS, ninety FPS. So this is good because our device supports up to ninety FPS only, and on Alto's ZDC we are getting ninety FPS. And I guess even if we turn off the high performance mode, it will be still same. So we are still getting ninety FPS. So it seems that the high performance mode is not contributing either. Uh, improving the gaming performance or reducing the gaming performance here on Oppo Reno 7 Pro 5G. So you can see 
how smooth is the gameplay no frame drops or lagging graphics quality is great and we are constantly getting 90 fps Now it's at 60 FPS, 64, once again back to 90, 64, so it's varying between 60 and 90 but most of the time it is at 90 FPS. So let's play it a bit more, so let's play it a bit more, so we are getting 70 FPS this time, once again going back to 90. So once again it is around 60 fps varying between 60 and 90 but the graphics quality was really good and everything is super nice as well and talking about the battery it's at 92 percent now so let's close all of them and now let's play call of duty mobile so here in the graphics setting of call of duty mobile by default high is selected for graphics quality and frame rate, I can go to very high and I can go to max frame rate as well on very high graphics quality. So this is the maximum possible graphics setting. I'm going to play the game on this. Let's see how much FPS we are going to get. If the FPS is low, then I will try to switch to the high performance mode and we will see whether we are going to get any better FPS or not. So we are getting 60 FPS as you can see. And actually this is the maximum possible FPS that we can get on Call of Duty Mobile so we are not going to get better than that anyway so this is quite nice that we are getting 60 FPS here on our Oppo Reno 7 Pro 5G on the highest possible graphics setting and as you can see the graphics quality is great if you have a look on the gun the reflection of the light the scratches the dent everything is super nice and the graphics quality is so good and it's quite smooth as well as you can see here very smooth So we are constantly getting 60 fps, 59 fps and graphics quality is brilliant. Thank you. 
And here we go. So everything was nice and smooth while playing Call of Duty Mobile on Oppo Reno 7 Pro 5G here. We were constantly getting 59 or 60 FPS and right now the battery percentage is 90 and temperature is at 35 degrees Celsius and the device is pretty much at the same temperature. It's not increased 35 is pretty common and performance was really nice for sure. So while playing Call of Duty Mobile you will get maximum possible FPS that's 60 on the highest possible graphic setting. So let's close it and now it's time to play Asphalt 9. So here in the graphic setting of Asphalt 9 you can see we have selected the high graphics quality and now let's play the game. So we are getting 50 FPS, graphics quality is brilliant. If you have a look on the road here, you can see how much detail we are getting. So good. Then the cars are colliding, the sparks and everything. So nice. The flame coming out of the exhaust. So good. And we are getting 50 FPS. Yeah, here I wrecked my car. <laughs> So we were getting constantly 50 FPS while playing as Fault 9 on Reno 7 Pro 5G. The graphics quality was brilliant as you can see it's still here and everything was nice and super smooth. So let's close this Fault 9 and now it's time to play the Dead Trigger 2. So this game can run at 120 FPS as well. Let's see how much FPS we are going to get on Reno 7 Pro 5G. So here in the graphics setting you can see by default Graphics is selected as default and FPS limit is at 90 because our device cannot support more than that. So I'm not sure by default what does it mean. So instead of default I'm going to select ultra high manually and FPS at 90. And now let's play the game. So as you can see we are getting 86, 90 FPS easily here. There is no frame drop or lagging happening and it's quite smooth as well as you can see here. So we are constantly getting 91 FPS, 89 FPS, so it's quite nice. The graphics quality is pretty good for sure. So if you are going to play Dead Trigger 2 on 
our Renault 7 Pro 5G here on the maximum possible traffic setting then it's going to be great as well So there was no frame drop, no lagging, graphics quality was good and we were getting constantly around 90 FPS while playing Dead Trigger 2 on Reno 7 Pro 5G. So let's close this one and now it's time to play the last game for today and that's going to be the PUBG Mobile. So here in the graphics setting of PUBG Mobile, by default HD graphics and high frame rate is selected. If I go to HDR, then I can select Ultra as well. Ultra HD onwards are not available and the extreme FPS is not coming on HDR and HD if I go to balanced as well. If I'm going to smooth then extreme FPS is getting possible but the graphics quality is at least value. So I'm going to select the combination of HDR graphics and ultra frame rate that's going to be the highest possible graphic setting for PUBG Mobile on Reno 7 Pro 5G. Let's play the game and let's see how good it's going to be. So the graphics quality is really nice, especially if you have a look on the costume of the character. We are getting good amount of detail on the shoulder pads and all. And we are getting 30 FPS here as you can see. And it's very smooth even though it's still getting only 30 FPS. So we are still getting 29-30 FPS, it's not getting better than that. But the graphics quality is really nice for sure. And it's pretty smooth as well. So I'm going to switch to the high performance mode one more time and let's see whether we are going to get any better performance or not. I really doubt it but let's give it a try. So it's still 30 FPS, it's not getting better. So as I said earlier, it does not matter much whether you are going to select the high performance mode or not, you will get pretty much same performance out of the device. So you can see how smooth it is and how much detail we are getting while playing PUBG Mobile on Reno 7 Pro 5G, but the FPS we are getting is constantly 29. It's not getting better than that.
So if you are a PUBG player, you should be getting the idea that how good is the gaming capability of Reno 7 Pro 5G. We are constantly getting 30 FPS while playing this game here. And after playing it for like one hour, the battery percentage moved to 81 and the temperature is 35 degrees Celsius. So that's all for now friends. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed watching this one, then give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe the channel and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notification for future uploads. And I will see you guys next time in an another video. Have a nice day.